or veterans and people who receive Social Security, Supplemental Security Income, or SSD, I should rejoice in this wonderful news opportunity. According to a recently announced payment payment schedule, a stimulus check in the amount of $2,000 is now expected to come on Monday. This particular film will provide you with all of the information that you desire concerning this upgrading. To get things started, let's make it clear who may be eligible to get this stimulus payment of $2,000. The following step is for us to provide you with specifics regarding the time frame in which you can anticipate receiving your money by providing an outline of the payment schedule. It is essential that you have a thorough understanding of the potential impact of this additional. Contribution could have on the benefits you currently get. Moreover, that will be taken care of as well. For the purpose of ensuring that your payment is received without any complications, we will guide you through the essential steps to ensure that you do not experience any disappointment. The Additionally, in order to keep you informed and prepared, we will address the issues and concerns that are most frequently asked. An extremely significant piece of news has just been reported, and it has the potential to impact millions of people in the United States. The federal government has disclosed a revised payment schedule for stimulus checks in the amount of $2,000 and the... Payments are scheduled to start as early as this coming Monday for those checks. Beneficiaries of the Supplemental Security Income, SSI, Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, and Veterans Affairs VA programs are the ones who are supposed to receive benefits from this program. It is possible that this information will prove to be useful to your budget in the next days, weeks, and months. After then, without further ado, let's carry out a comprehensive analysis of this new stimulus package. The rising cost of goods and services, the unpredictability of the economy and the ongoing effects of the COVID-19 epidemic have all contributed to the burden that has been placed on national household budgets in recent years. Senior citizens and people with disabilities who frequently have low financial resources have experienced this impact to a greater degree. It has been determined that these issues exist and the government has made the decision to take action. With the implementation of this new stimulus plan, some of our countrymen who are the most economically challenged will receive immediate relief. By concentrating on people who are receiving Social Security, SSI, SSDI and VIA programs, the objective is to provide assistance to those persons who may be experiencing the greatest amount of difficulty as a result of the current economic crisis. You should keep in mind that the stimulus package is not the same as the welfare payments that you typically receive. Over the course of these challenging times, this is a one-time payment that is intended to be of some assistance. Simple requirements must be met in order to qualify for this stimulus payout. People who are already receiving benefits from the following programs are eligible to receive this stimulus payment, Social Security Retirement, Supplemental Security Income, Social Security Disability Insurance, or Veterans Affairs Virginia payments. The individuals who are included in this category are retirees and their families, individuals who are receiving Supplemental Security Income, SSI, individuals who are receiving Supplemental Security Income, SSDI, due to a handicap that makes it impossible for them to work and veterans who are receiving benefits from the Veterans Affairs VA, such as disability compensation, pension or survivor benefits, there is a requirement that you are already getting benefits from one of these programs in order to submit an application. Should you have submitted an application for benefits but have not yet been granted permission, it is possible that you will not be eligible for this stimulus payment. However, in contrast to other stimulus programs that have been implemented in the past, this payout does not include a maximum income requirement. Regardless of the amount of money that a beneficiary already possesses, they will still receive the full $2,000 by participating in these activities. In spite of the fact that you receive benefits from numerous programs, you will still only receive a single payment of $2,000. The stimulus will be distributed in the form of a lump sum to each individual, rather than individually to each benefit program. It has been announced by the administration that the distribution of the stimulus payments will begin on Monday of this week. Having stated that, I would like to bring to your attention the fact that not everyone will receive their money on the same day. Over the course of several days, the distribution will be gradually reduced it's for the purpose of preventing the financial system from becoming overloaded. Beneficiaries of Social Security retirement are anticipating that they will begin receiving payments on Monday, followed by those receiving SSI on Tuesday, Social Security Disability Insurance on Wednesday, and Veterans Affairs benefits on Thursday. It is possible that the processing of certain payments will take longer than anticipated, and this schedule is not yet finalized. According to the government, if you have not received your payment by the end of the next week, you are strongly advised to get in touch with the relevant department since they will provide you with additional information. You can anticipate the same method of payment as you would with your typical benefits. If you select that mode of deposit, both your monthly benefits and your stimulus payment will be deposited into the same bank account without any additional steps being required. You will receive your money in the shortest amount of time if you pay using this option. In the event that you get your benefits through the Direct Express method, your stimulus payment will be credited to your respective Direct Express card. The same way that you receive your normal benefits, your stimulus payment will be delivered to you through the mail. It should be brought to your attention that the arrival time for electronic payments is normally within a few days. However, the arrival time for paper checks may be slightly longer. If you want to obtain this award, there is absolutely no need for you to perform any kind of activity. In the event that you are eligible, the government will make use of the information that they have on file in order to transfer the payment to you automatically. 
In order to get your stimulus payment, you should refrain from responding to any calls, emails or messages that ask for sensitive information or ask for cash. Frauds are most likely to be involved here. Unfortunately, con artists will attempt to take advantage of large government programs wherever there is money involved in the transaction. It is important to keep in mind that there is absolutely no obligation placed on you in order to obtain this money. You are able to receive your stimulus check from the government without having to pay any money, and they have all of the information that they require to complete the process efficiently. Under no circumstances should you reveal private information to a random person, including your social security number or bank account details. When it comes to this, stimulus program, the only sources of official official information that will be cited are official government websites or social media accounts. Please only place your faith in information that comes from reliable sources. Uh, it is never acceptable for anyone to be concerned that their benefits may be withdrawn just because they refuse to pay a fee or provide information that has been asked. Any type of threat similar to this would be a warning sign that a fraud is taking place. Always rely on official government websites such as, such as Social Security Administration, SSA or Veterans Affairs, VA for the most up-to-date and correct information. If you believe that a con artist has approached you, you should file a complaint with the Federal Trade Commission at FTC.gov. Maintaining a state of perpetual alertness is one of the ways in which each of us can ensure that our communities and ourselves are protected against fraudulent activity. There is a possibility that a payment of $2,000 will have an impact on a large number of households, particularly those with fixed incomes. The only thing that should determine how you should spend this stimulus money is your own personal financial situation. Nonetheless, there are a few other possibilities that you should take into consideration. In the event that you have fallen behind on any payments due to rising expenses, this may be your opportunity to get caught up and get back on track. Paying rent, utilities or medical bills are all examples of expenses that fall into this category. It is possible that you will wind up saving money if you utilize a portion of this to pay off debt with a high interest rate, such as obligations on credit cards. You might want to consider keeping some of it away for use in the event of the rain. Having even a small emergency fund can help ease the worry and anxiety that comes along with financial issues. It is possible that this presents an opportunity for people with disabilities to obtain the necessary modifications to their homes in order to make them more accessible. The fact that you have been putting off dealing with your health problems such as getting the treatments you require or paying for the drugs you require may now be a chance for you to take care of those difficulties. Especially in light of the fact that the price of power is on the rise, investing in energy efficient appliances and making improvements to your home could help you save money on your monthly energy bills. In the event that you rely on technology to maintain communication with loved ones or to monitor and monitor your health, this may be an excellent opportunity for you to upgrade your older electronic devices. Because this is a one-time purchase, you should examine not just how. You will pay for things at this moment, but also how it might influence your financial situation in the future. If you are unsure how to make use of this unexpected windfall, it is advisable to seek the help of a trustworthy member of your family or a family or a financial specialist. There are a lot of people that have questions about this stimulus payment. This stimulus payment will not have any impact on the benefits that you receive from Social Security, Supplemental Security Income or Veterans Affairs as they are normally received. There is an additional one-time charge for this payment. In accordance with the government's position, this stimulus payout will not be considered taxable income. Having said that, it is advisable to consult with a tax professional about your own particular circumstances. At this point in time, it is not apparent whether or not this stimulus payment will be protected by the same safeguards as your regular payments, which are typically exempt from debt collection. If you are concerned about this matter, you should discuss it with a lawyer or an organization that provides legal help. Those who are eligible for this stimulus program will receive a total of $2,000. It is recommended that a second payment of $2,000 be paid to any dependents who are qualified to receive separate payments. This includes children who are receiving survivor benefits, for example. When it comes to dependents who do not receive their own benefits, however, further payments will not be provided. In the same way that you would receive the beneficiary's normal payments, a representative payee for Social Security SSI or VA benefits ought to also receive the stimulus payment, it is appropriate for the beneficiary to be the one who benefits from the utilization of the funds. As long as you are a citizen of the United States, and you are, receiving benefits from Social Security or the Veterans Administration, you should still be eligible to receive this stimulus payment. It is going to be sent to you in the same manner as your regular perks. The immediate financial assistance of individuals is the major objective of this stimulus program, however. It is highly probable that it will also have repercussions that are more far-reaching for the economy. Because this dividend is going to be distributed to millions of people in the United States, we ought to anticipate an increase in the amount of money spent by consumers. From this, it is possible that the economy and local businesses will receive a boost. In the event that this money is used to settle current obligations, a significant number of people in the United States may experience an improvement in their financial state as well as their credit ratings. Uh, there is a possibility that some individuals will choose to decide to set this money aside. Being able to increase the pace of savings on a national basis is possible.